plus h. Even plus h. And they do plus h. They will do plus h. They will do plus h. How many things? So what is f of x bar? So f is a machine that swallows a vector and gives you the first component of it. So this spits out the first component of it. So, so if this machine is working on this vector, so what output it gives? Okay. Given plus h minus h. Okay. So, so the computational trick is this: if you want to compute the derivative of scalar value functions, what you can do? Compute this this difference, and when you will compute this difference, you will always see that there will be two terms appearing actually. One purely in the terms of h, nothing else. Purely in the terms of h, and other term and other expression involves a and h together, so that you can can't separate them. Okay? So the term that is purely in the terms of h, then you give it a name L of h because that is your candidate for the derivative. Okay? And the term that involves a and h both, that is the error actually. So when I computed this difference, I turns out that h1. So I got h1, and I got nothing else actually. So this means that this is my candidate for being derivative or the output of the derivative plus zero error. So what I need to do? Take that, you know, because I have to compute this limit. So I have to compute this limit. Right? Norm of h goes to zero. Norm of h goes to zero. Okay, so I want to compute this limit. So I need to do what? I need to bring in L of h on other side and then divide everything by norm of h and take the limit. So what I did? I took h1 on other side, divided by the norm of h and I took the limit to norm of h goes to 0. And it turns out that the expression on the other side is going to 0 because it's already 0. So therefore, by definition, it tells me that this is really the fresh derivative of the given function or the, this, this expression is the best linear approximation to the given function at the point here. Sir, you are function That's what, is, that's what we are going to do next actually. We can we can take another function. Yeah, so that's like that. Our function comes up. Otherwise, we can do it in the next class. Or